In this video, I'll show you where you can find these little things, these little pop-up texts, and we can change that. Okay, here we are on my desktop, and the first thing you need to do is to make a working folder to build your resource pack in. And it's right here, I just called it title, and I put it on my C drive. The next thing we need to do is to get the vanilla resource pack out of the game. So I'll bring the launcher up. Now in here, click on installations, and then your current game should be the top one on the list. Go over here and click on that little folder right there. This will bring up the Minecraft folder. Let's now bring back up our working folder. There it is. And then in here, go inside of versions. Right now I'm playing in 1.16.5. Go inside of that, and you should see two files in here, one a .jar, one a .json. Now you want to copy this over into your working folder. So I'll just right drag that, use that right mouse button, drag it over here, and copy. There you go. Now we need to open this thing up in a new folder. Type over .jar and make us say .zip. Click outside and then choose yes. So I'll right click and we're going to open this up in a new window. Now there are a couple things we need out of here. Scroll way down a little further and that's right here. You want the pack MC meta file and the pack PNG file. So let's right drag those over and copy and then back up to the top again. Go inside of assets, go inside of Minecraft and inside of texts. And here's a file you want, it's called splashes.txt. That's where all those little pop-up text things are. So you want to have this one copied as well. So I'm going to put this up here so that this line is showing. Copy this up here. Make a new folder. Call it Assets. There it is. Go inside of this one. New folder. Call it Minecraft. Go inside of that. New folder. Texts. There we go. Inside of that right drag that over here copy and there we go now this is a text file i like using notepad plus plus it's a free program i already have mine installed so i'm just going to right click edit here with notepad plus plus now to change this all you have to do is just to type over any one of these lines in here and make it say whatever it is that you want now i'm going to delete all of this stuff and select that hit the delete key i've now removed everything now let's type in htg resource pack Penguin Limbo, that's my Minecraft character. Custom packs are great. And then choose Save. And you can put in as much as you want into this one or leave the original and then just change some of those lines. That's all set to go. Okay, now we need to make this into a resource pack. So we'll go back here to our working folder and we need to combine this, this, and this into a pack. If you want to change the title of the pack that's inside of this, the format is already correct because we grabbed the right resource pack for this. And let's just change our title. Let's call it custom splashes and save and that's done. Okay, now grab these three files here, the assets folder and these two files and then go up here to share, click on zip and then give this one a name. I'll call it splashes. We now need to get this inside of the game and that's easy to do. Let's go back here to the launcher, back to that folder. This time we're looking for the resource packs folder. It's right there. Open that one up, put that right here and it'll bring back up our other folder and then simply take this and drag it into that location. There it is. It's now inside of the resource packs for the game. We can close that, close that. All we have left to do now is just to activate that resource pack in the game. So click on play, launch the game to the title screen. Okay, here we are at the game. Let's go down to options, resource packs right here. Left hand side, there's these splashes that we just did. Click on that arrow. It's over here, right hand side. Now choose done. Let that load in this new resource pack. Now for this to show up, we're going to have to quit the game and then reload the game again through the launcher. So I'll quit game and we'll then relaunch that. And the reason why we're relaunching this at this point is because it loads in that one screen when the game first loads up. So if we change the resource pack after that point, it doesn't reload that part of it. Okay, click on play. And there we go. There's our new splashes text right there. And that was the top one on the line. Each time you open it up, you'll of course get a different one off of that big list. If you like this video, hit that like button, click on share, click on subscribe, check out my channel for a bunch more Minecraft videos, and I'll see you next time.